All right, welcome back to Big Pools Down Under, round 12, AFL season. It is the midway point of the year, and it is our 500 sub giveaway. Major prize being the team coach box. Two minor prizes of a stand and a card of your choice from my double ups. So with the major prize, if you are the winner of the major prize, I will require verification that you are subscribed to the channel. So contact me on Instagram with a screenshot showing that you are subscribed to my channel. Um, being such a major prize and an expensive one, I need to make sure that it is a subscri subscriber that has won the box. As for the other two prizes, contact me on Instagram and I will give you a list of my team star powers and wildcard double ups and you can pick your stand as well and we'll get that sent off to you. Today's video is going to be my first folder update of the year. So hopefully you guys can enjoy that and see what how my collection is going at the moment. But before we get into that, let's pick ourselves a winner of the team coach box and the two minor prizes. Three, two, one. Good luck everyone. Here we go. Schultzy. Well, there you go, Schultzy. You've been, I know you've been a, on the channel for a very long time and a regular commenter. Unbelievable. Well done, mate. Hopefully you can get yourself a nice Gold Coast Suns card in that box. Greatly deserved. What have you said there? Congrats to the winners. Con congrats to you, Big Pools. And no way you deleted that footage so stiff. <laughs> yeah, referring to me accidentally deleting my Friday video. Unbelievable. But there we go, guys. That's the first winner. It is Schultzy. Congratulations, mate. Get in contact with me over on Instagram and we'll sort everything out. All right. First minor prize for one of my double ups and a stand in three, two, one. Congratulations to Hatta. His comment was 600 subs soon. Thanks mate, I really appreciate that. Get me, get in contact with me over on Instagram. I'll get your details. I'll give you a list of the cards you can pick from and you can pick yourself a stand and I'll post that out to you as soon as possible. Thanks for the support. Cheers mate. And now for the second minor prize and final prize of today's giveaway. Good luck everyone. Three, two, one. We have got Sam Osborne Smith. Congrats on 500 subs, well deserved, and I hope there are more subs to come in the future. I love the vid as always. Congratulations, buddy. Get in contact with me over on Instagram and I'll give you a list of the, the double ups I have. You can pick yourself a stand and we'll get that posted out to you. Just a big thank you to everybody that's subbed and liked and commented on all the videos. I can't thank you guys enough. Absolutely appreciate it. There'll be plenty more giveaways. Next target is 750 for the next major giveaway. Hopefully we can get there this season. If not, there's always next. Now, let's get into the folder update. Cheers, everyone. Now, let's get in to the folder update. So as you can see in front, we've got the commons. So we've all seen the commons. I've got the full set of commons. Sorry if the camera's a bit funny. Um, I still haven't worked out the perfect way to do a folder update with my setup that I have, but we don't really need to have a good look at the commons. We've all seen them. I have the full set. They weren't as easy as previous years, that's for sure. It took a few few boxes to get it done. And then, um, what's going on there? Oh, it's stuffed up somewhere. But yeah. That's the commons. We'll just scoop through that. We don't really need to see this. So yeah, I've completed the silver set as well. Um, one thing about all the, I, I really don't like the team coach folder. The pages don't lay flat enough unless you force it. You know, they get a bit bulky even with just putting, I mean, I only feel one side still bend up but really happy with how the silvers look this year I think they did a magnificent job 
an awesome looking set. Much better than last year's. Last year's was very, I don't know how to put it, cheap looking. Um, but now that they've put like the color of the team color in the background with the silver, it looks a lot better anyway, in my opinion. Um, oh, I'm missing a couple. What happened there? I must have taken them out for a reason. I've no doubt got them somewhere. I've got thousands of spares. Well, not thousands, but you know what I mean. So yeah, you see how like it gets all bulked up there? Hopefully it's coming up on the camera all right. I'm sorry if it's not. It's a very, my camera's not the best to set up to looking down at a folder. But I mean, we've all seen these anyway. Hopefully the better cards stand out. So here's my Silver Team Powers collection. Um, yeah, stuffed up. <laughs> I just couldn't be bothered resetting them all the way back, so I've just left it. So I've got all of them bar two. I've realized so um, I think yeah it's one for Fremantle I'm missing I don't know which player that is um, and I think it's one for West Coast maybe that I'm missing fantastic set I think they've done a really good job the base the common Silver Star it looks really good just as it is so I think I deserve a pat on the back for that for making such good looking common sets like the silver common and these silvers here are really nice oh yeah there we go that's a, that's the other one that's missing it's an eagle one not sure who it is have all them and then we have our AFL fantasy favorites so I've got all them but one. I believe that is someone from the Demons. Um, where's the Demons? There we go, yeah, see there's one there. One missing right there for the Demons that I need. Um, but other than that, I've got the rest. All right, so here's my car cross. Now I've got quite a few of these. Uh, missing one, number one for Charlie Cameron. I've got all of the Adelaide ones. And I've got, um, I'm missing one for Daniel Rich, one for Sam Doherty, but I've got all of Harry McKay. I'm going quite well with them, actually. Missing one for Geordie Degowie, uh, one for Darcy Moore. I've got all of Sammy Draper. I uh, got all of Darcy Parrish, uh, missing one for Caleb Sarong and one for Michael Walters. And obviously I'm missing all the gold collages, so we might as well say two for whatever I'm missing, or three. Uh, I got all the Geelong ones, I stuffed up here. Um, and yeah, I just didn't go back and fix it. Um, I'm missing quite a few of these. I've hardly got any Gold Coast or GWS. I've got, I'm missing one James Sicily. I've got all Chad Wingard. I'm missing one Angus Brayshaw. I've got all the Clayton Olivers. Uh, missing most of the North Melbourne ones. Uh, missing two for Ollie Wines. I've got all the Shea Bolton. Uh, I've got all Prestia and all the Saints. Got all of Isaac Heaney. I'm missing two for Luke Parker. I've got all of Jeremy McGovern because of that stuff up on the very first page. <laughs> I'm a page short, so I've had to double up the backs. Um, and yeah, I've got all the Bulldogs, and I'm missing one for Elliot Yo. So yeah, that's all my card crafts and Silver Star Powers. So this one here would have uh, my Scanlons and the gold cards. So I've got all the Scanlons, got them really early, they're not really hard to complete. Um, stunning card, I absolutely love them. I love the retro look about it. If only I could get my hands on an actual retro. 
but yeah, they've done really well. Even the photography doesn't look, you know, high definition to today's standards, but it doesn't look horrible enough to wreck the picture. Got all the best and fairest. Not one of my favorite cards. I think it's pretty much the same as last year, really. Not really that well done. Uh, not very much quality control on them. There's a lot of damage on all the cards. Uh, here we have all our golds. I'm not too fussed about the codes, help yourself if I haven't used them. So, I've got quite a few golds. I tried to keep them in order, I probably shouldn't have. Uh, Jordan Dawson, so the, not many at the start there. Uh, we've got a few of the pies. So I've got quite a few actually. That collection is coming along quite nicely. It's such a big set, I doubt I'll get them all. I really do. You get so many double ups um, quite often. So, but yeah, they're a nice looking card. I like this edition. I love the basic black and white background with the color photo and the gold trim. Simple but neat. But once again, it's such a big set like the canvas was last year. It's, I don't know, I'm not, I'm not such a fan of them adding such huge sets to collect when there is already so much to collect. So, but it is what it is. So yeah, there's quite a lot in here. Alright, now we've got our odd bods and I'm missing one odd bod. I love the Sammy Draper one, it's one of my favourites. The ball legit looks like it's coming out of the card. There's not many that do that. The Hue Magnet does a little bit, but nothing like the Draper one. Sam the Spoiler does it a little bit. I think I'm yeah, missing the other Melbourne one. So hopefully I can get that soon. All right, now we're on into some box hits. As you can see, I've got four for the Crows. In the Team Star Power, I've got three for North Melbourne. Got one for Brisbane, got one for Melbourne. Absolutely stunning set. Really, really impressed with this design. It's not over the top. There's not way too much going on. Just enough to make it look like it's a you know, a special insert. All right, and then I've got one for the Eagles, which is Nick Nat. Got a couple there for the Blues, Crips and Doherty. Dylan Shield and Nick Martin for the Bombers. I've got Tomahawk and Cam Guthrie for Geelong. Luke Parker for the Swans. Jamie Elliott for the Mighty Pies. You got Tuke Miller for the Suns. Andrew Brayshaw for the Dockers. Jack McRae for the Doggies. I've got two for the Giants, I've got three for the Saints. Steel, King and Membry. Right, now we're on to the Best and Ferris. I've got quite a few of these and I've got a lot of double ups. These things follow me around like crazy. We've got Brisbane, we've got Essendon, Collingwood, the Suns and Geelong on that first page. And then on the second page, we've got Hawthorne, Melbourne, North Melbourne, Port Adelaide, Richmond, Bulldogs and the Eagles, so I've got most of them going all right. That I just seem to hit so many. I don't know what it is about them. All right, so we've got our wild cards now. So we've got Darcy Fogarty up here, Jack Silvani. These are the Magics in order. Andrew Brayshaw, Jack Ginnivan, Tom Green, and Noel Anderson. They look amazing this year. I absolutely love this set. I love all the wild card sets. And we've got Jack Sinclair. Noah Bolter and Chad Warner in the Magics to round it out for my Magic collection. In the Star Wilds, we have got Dane Zorka at the top, Jack Crisp, Toby Green, Jack Lacocious, and Cam Guthrie. Very nice looking sets too, aren't they? The Star Wilds, I love them. And then to round out the Star Wild cards, we've got Aaron Norton and Shai Bolton. 
Now we're into my gallery wild cards. So we've got Big Joe Danaher and Scott Pendlebury for the pies. These are an awesome addition, absolutely stunning. Love them. They've done really well here. And to round out the galleries, we've got Brad Crouch down the bottom there. Probably my favorite looking wild card, the new edition, the rookie wild cards. Absolutely look amazing. The rookie stamp really makes it stand out. A bit more prestigious with the, you know, the rookie wild card on the side. Absolutely love it. Great idea. Then we've got Josh Rochelle, Ben Hobbs, Nick Dacos, and Finn Callahan. And we've got Josh Ward and Jacob Van Ruen to round out the rookie wild cards. Absolutely love them. Doing all right with them. I'm happy with how many I've got so far with, so, with another half of the year to go. All right, now we're into the fantasy duos. Great addition. I think the design lets them down, so hopefully that gets improvement next year. But it's still a part of the set. I still got to collect them. So we've got Adelaide, Brisbane, Carlton, Essendon, the Suns and GWS. And then we've got the Hawks and the Saints. So I've got a few already, quite a few actually. More than I'd like to have pulled from a box, knowing that I, <laughs> I believe it's a curse when you hit one. But like I said, you've still got to get all 18, so got to go for it. Here, we just have some double ups. So these are my game changers. Move that. And now I've got some double up duos, some game changers, double up Tom Green, Magic Wildcard, uh, Noah Anderson, Jacob Van Ruin, Jack Silvani, we've got a double up Team Star Powers in the Tomahawk, Aaron Hall, Patrick Cripps, we've got Rory Laird in the Team Star Power, we've got another Suns Fantasy Duo and a Shia Bolton Star Wild double up. So that's all that done. Now we're gonna get into the big boys and we'll see my case hits so far this season. All right, now for all the case hits I have in my collection this year. So we'll start off with the gallery, gold gallery wild cards. We've got Luke Shuey for the West Coast Eagles. Absolutely stunning these cards. Great addition to the set. And they've done really well. They look amazing with just the, the bang of gold in it. We've also got Ben King in the gold gallery wild card. Equally as stunning. I just absolutely love them. Great addition, team coach. Well done. Then we have my first case hit of the season, which is the Patrick Cripps Silver Trophy wildcard. I was very happy to see that. I was starting to wonder if I was ever going to see one. They are amazing. Tyson Beck has done an amazing job with the, the holographic background and all, every, all the little details in it, from the badge to everything. Absolutely stunning. Love them. And I think these top them again, the, the neons are absolutely stunning. You know, they were stunning last year and they've, they've actually eclipsed them with these. This is the Jamie Elliott one. Absolutely stoked to have a Collingwood one that I pulled myself. And we have the Andrew Brayshaw. I pulled this on a Sunday sesh video. Absolutely stunning. Look at that, they absolutely pop. AFL Players Association MVP, gold trophy wildcard. Doesn't get any better than that when you pull your own, unless you pull your own PC hit. Amazing stuff. Here's one of two that I bought. Jack Ginnivan, Anzac Day medalist gold trophy wildcard. So happy to have this, and I'm so happy to have the one I'm gonna show you next. Absolutely stunning, look at them. Absolutely love them. And then the holy grail for the year, the big boy. Nick Dacos, Nab Rising Star, Gold Trophy Wildcard, what a card. This is my Holy Grail for the year. Didn't matter about anything else until I got this. So I have this and now I can focus on so many other cards, either from Select or Team Coach, but I'm so happy to have this. Absolutely stunning. Well, there you go, guys. That is my folder update. That is about, it is round 12, so it's the halfway mark, so we'll do another one, the final one, around round 24 to the first or second week of finals, somewhere around that day. Hope you enjoyed that. Sorry if the quality wasn't that great, but I'll work on it. 
If you liked that video, you know what I want you to do. Smash that thumbs up button. If you're new around here and you want to see some more box breaking, loose pack ripping, giveaways, folder updates, you name it, we do it around here. Hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell. And as always, I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.